Hello everyone, welcome to the Quest Mage and welcome back to another No Man's Sky video. And in today's video, I want to talk about why the new Interceptor update is still not on Nintendo Switch. So sit back, relax, click like, subscribe and hopefully enjoy. Here we go. I want to start today's video by saying thank you so, so much to everyone that watched the last video and a special thank you to everyone that commented, liked and subscribed. Your support is inspiring and keeps this channel going. So once again, thank you very, very much. Now, the Interceptor update or the 4.2 update is not on the Nintendo Switch. And the reason you can't update the game to play the new content is because, well, it's just not available, at least yet. At the time of making this video, it's been six days since the original launch of the Interceptor update, and it's still not on the Nintendo Switch. The worst part of this all is we don't know when it will be. So like I said, six days ago, the Interceptor update was shown to us all and we all saw it and it said this. PC, PS4, PS5, Nintendo Switch, Xbox One, Xbox Series S, X and Xbox Game Pass which made us all believe that the update is going to be available on the Nintendo Switch at the same time as other platforms. Well, unfortunately, it wasn't. I am currently working on the assumption that this update will come to the Switch, as if it wasn't, I think Hello Games would have changed their wording to something like coming to all next-gen platforms and computer, eliminating the need to mention the Nintendo Switch at all. It is a big shame that since then, nothing has been said by the developers about why the Nintendo Switch version has not been updated. Maybe they are not in a position to do so, but you'd think that at this point informing the user base would be a good idea. To be fair, usually Hello Games, well at least nowadays, are good at handling PR, but this time I think if they could, they should inform the No Man's Sky community on Nintendo Switch that it would take longer for the update to be available on this console. Now I play No Man's Sky on Switch out of choice, but there are many for whom this is their only way to play the game, or they might have just bought this game. I really do hope that this update is available this week for the Switch, but if not, that Halo Games lets us know when it will be available. This way we could have a chat about what we could expect from the update in the meantime, and not just wonder if if it's coming to the Switch at all. I would definitely prefer a date range like two weeks as opposed to not knowing and checking the Switch every day to see if there's an update. Now lastly, I can't help but feel, well, left out. Not only because the update is not available, but at the lack of communication this far. Don't get me wrong, I'm still very much looking forward to this update, but that's also why not knowing if it's coming at all is a little bit of an issue. Bearing in mind, we are talking about free content, but at the end of the day, it is content that has been announced that that we still don't have. But it looks so fun that I think we all want to experience the new features and just have a bit of a chat about it all. Hopefully it will be on Switch soon. How about all of you? Are you waiting for the update on Switch? Is this your only way to play No Man's Sky? Please let me know down in the comments. But that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you very much again for watching. If you like what I do here, please click that like button down below. If you want to see more, then please click that subscribe button as that is the only way this channel can grow. Now I hope you liked this video and I hope to see you in the next one and until then, thanks again.